Hi everyone, you found what to connect for bringing your feeling this awesome in gaming. So this is Kingdom Draw. Um, it looked interesting. We tried to pick up something different from the indie community as a developer um, is launching their company. So whether they're working on storyline or interface or gameplay or even just art style, um, the delivery is going to be different. Um, so we go in and we try to find an indie developer that's going to publish more games and you'll be able to follow along with um, their, um, you know, ascent, hopefully in the greatness. Um, if not, you know, you'll just find somebody who will continuously produce games that you can follow along and purchase. Alright, so we're doing a new one, Game Alias, we can just do all the area. It's been a while, it's been a minute since I used that one. Oh shoot, I just clicked past something important. Hey, do I do that? Tips on the screen, you can look at your available cards and modify your deck. More card packs you open, the better. So I have an undead deck. Uh, we have different campaigns and we can um, work with friends or we can do um, a storyline basically. So we're gonna start out as a cultist. For months, the nightmares were vivid. They twisted his mind, compelling him from his home and family. The powerful compulsions drew the mortal across the countryside, through mountain ranges, and into the great western deserts. Twisted by dark forces, his mind sought just one goal. So he goes to the mountains, he finds a cult, and they imbue him with dark powers. When the process was complete, he was only partly his former self and partly something else. Come forth, Zerus. And here, Master. Oh my goodness, look at my makeup. I, I had this glorious makeover, clearly got the seaweed wrap, slurped the stress out. Can you feel the shadows will, Zerus? Yes, Master. Shadow beckons a long and difficult fate for you, Zerus. Before you embrace this fate, you shall test your new powers. The human county of Avondale is waiting for you, unsuspecting souls ripe for the harvest. Destroy the human garrison in the region so that we may raise an army of the undead from the surrounding villages. So you command master. Objective is destroy the enemy base, protect your base. So you can buy cards um, to buff your deck up. Or you can just play through as a normal campaign. Target enemy deals more damage to your next turn. Protect to discard a random card. Okay, so we can select the redraw or we can just begin the campaign. Looks like I'm up against a Sir Blaine. He's got a decent sized deck. Mine's undead, which is pretty boss most of the time. So there's me. Here's this county. Necromancer. Raise an army of skeletons after defeating an army. So discard a random card to gain six power. So we're going to go ahead and just buff ourselves up here, see if we can't win any points that way. Any other options. We can surrender the game or I can continue, basically. Necromancer or protect it. Try to play a support card. I'm aware of that. I'm trying to play protect it. Where can my skeletons go, friend? There we go. Blank spot. I just played an army card. They can't move the same turn. So I have until next turn. Next. There we go. He goes and gets a foot soldier. Makes sense. Castle generates a gold. Other resources power. He empowers through cards and traits. Goes in the bottom line. Dark Ritual. Four games with 12 power. So I'm out cards, I have an army unit, and I have a decent amount of power. So I should be able to do some damage. Spirit, give me strength. He buffs his. You can defeat an opponent by destroying their castle. Most of your cards have the protected rate, they will take one damage. Castle's health is in the bottom right. Um, I'm not really going to be able to do that, but I can move my skeleton, so let's do that. 
just kind of deal our way through this. I missed a, an ability, or a <laughs> turn where I could have used that uh, ability. You know, kind of move forward there, but what you gonna do? Oh, I can keep moving, okay. Pros and cons of gaming. Not really used to this setup, so that's good because it means that I've never run into it before, so I can move for you as well. He's not gonna be able to move. You just played a beast card, so they can they can move on the same turn. Better for cost. Get out in front, homie. Wow, they're fast too. Oh, it's flying it. Okay, that's why. Ignore train restrictions can move three tiles. Interesting. So I can move them over the mountains. These guys I have to move a little more slowly. I wonder what's gonna happen when I hit the river. Okay, so I'm gonna have skeletons. I strike quick and deadly. Cool, so we have some rogues on the board now. Not enough gold. Ooh, I gotta go loot somebody. Hold on. Let me go kill this guy. Use support. Army cards can roam the map. Healing gained. Ouch. So. Can I attack on the same turn? It looks like I can't, which is unfortunate. We're learning the hard way here, son. We're learning the hard way. raise my army of skeletons just yet either, although we know it's coming. Answer, I got a ghoul, not enough gold. I thought I got a gold every turn. Odd. Oh, we'll just beat the crap out of him. Not enough gold. Oh my god, I definitely expected to be able to raise him from the dead, so that's unfortunate. Protected, so I should be able to assault the castle, but it looks like I can only move one square because of it. Odd. Get another one of these puppies out here and just kind of haul butt over to the castle. Got. The disease slowed down. I don't know if it's because they took damage. Potentially terrain. Great. Got some hawks. Alright. Raise an army. Not You know, destroy a friendly army to deal for damage. For area damage. You could take out these guys. Should have gotten them closer to the castle. Like I said, we're kind of learning the hard way here. If you're interested in the game, the link is in the description below. Also down there is Gamer Grind. Gamer Coffee Gilded is too good. We'll let you put your logo on March so you can support the Pirate Queen. Uh, support what to play next year. Also down there is Gamer Grind. Gamer Coffee delivered to your door. So, um, really just a fun time. Uh, all my social my media sites. links. Go there. I don't think I want to do that just yet. It's not gonna let me do that, so I guess we'll continue to protect the castle. Lost my protected unit. Glorious. No Definitely way. need another army unit. About to get my butt kicked here. Dark ritual discard a random card. Oh, that was a good one too. I just will just throw myself on it, or else I'm gonna get taken out by his soldiers here. So six days out of seven, what we do is find something like this that's kind of advancing gaming. So this is advancing strategy gaming um, and trying out different things to make it work. So it's a cool premise, cool idea. Spirit, give me strength. Um, even if the controls weren't what I expected, which is normal, um, I don't do card games nearly as much. So um, interesting choice of abilities here. It definitely keeps you involved as the general of the army. Um, link in the description below. Um, liking, subscribing, commenting, that is always totally free, so definitely hit us off. If you hit the bell, you just get an alert for what's going on in gaming. It's basically what I showcase. Um, you'll be able to click on, see if you want to click on the thumbnail and, um, you know, bump off, get something a little bit extra on your day. Um, 
it's an interesting group to always be able to talk about, you know, um, just kind of know what's going on. So it's a fun one to stay up on. This looks interesting if you like something um, that kind of paces you, you know? So you just kind of pace your way out. Um, oh my gold. You have to manage your resources pretty well. Victory is assured. Then I imagine you get a little bit more storyline um, as you work your way through and conquer this for your cultists and work your way up in the ranks. So that's also cool, um, where they just kind of keep it going, you know? Someone's just so the cards are very...